What's good, YouTube? Because of Kami here. So we got a request from Susie. Susie, this is a cool ass request right here. So this is Youngblood doing his version of I Was Made for Loving You by Kiss. I'm excited to see what he does with this. He's such a diverse artist and he does have a very powerful voice. And I know he can hit high notes very well, so... I want, I want to, I'm interested to see what he's going to do with the high section of this song, the falsetto section, because those are some really high notes in this song. Thank you, Susie, for sending this, because I mentioned it in that Q&A, that's what gave you the idea to send this to me. I did not know that he had done this. This is recent, like three months ago. Yeah, three months ago. So... I'm very excited for this. This is one of my favorite Kiss songs ever, and to have an artist like Youngblood do it is honestly very fitting. Definitely something I would expect for Youngblood to do, actually. This is this is so random that it makes sense when it comes to an artist like Youngblood. I really, really am glad that we're going to get to listen to this. So... If you guys are new here, subscribe for me. We talk about mental health, addiction, world issues, everything in between. Break down all the lyrics, instrumentation. I like going the whole nine yards. I'm busting the lyrics out for you guys. This song, well, it's obvious what this song is about. It's a very, very tongue-in-cheek kind of song, as Kiss's songs all are. Every single one of them, right, is very much so. Got... A lot of tongue-in-cheek kind of lyrics in it. That's just their style of writing, and I love that about them. So, we'll cover the lyrics, but I'm more interested, honestly, in seeing what Youngblood does with this in his own style. Because, like I said, he's got his own thing going on musically. So, this is right up the alley of, like, the level of a random cover that I would expect from him. So, I'm excited, man. If you guys are struggling with mental health or addiction, please go get yourself help, man. There's people who want to see you do better and that are willing to help you. Most of them have been through it themselves. It's something I went through and that I pulled myself out of. So I totally understand what it's like to go through that struggle and pull yourself out of it and work on building your life back up and finding better things for yourself. It's a hell of a time and there's a lot of growth and a lot of learning and everything that goes into it. But at the end of the day, you can live a better life and you can inspire other people to do the same thing in whatever way it is that you choose to do that with yourself, right? So please, go get help if you need it. I'm excited for this. Susie, thank you again. We're going to get into this. I'm Vikasa Kavi. A reaction video a day keeps the doctor away. Fuck those apples. We got young blood. I was made for loving you. Tonight... <laughs> I wanna give it all to you mm. In the darkness There's so much I wanna do I like this And tonight I wanna lay it at your feet Cause girl I was made for you And girl you were made for me This song turned into a more ballad style with a like sullen aspect to it and the rasp on his vocals as well that he's just starting to jump into here. Very, very gritty kind of voice. Like, it's so beautiful. It, this adds a whole layer to this song. This song has a lot more meaning when it's heard like this outside of a more dancey kind of groove to it. When it's put to this tempo and approached like this, this is like some really classic, sullen, western kind of music, right? Like that you would hear in a movie for a love scene. I like what he's done here. This is very good. I really like this. Hold on.
now he's picking it up. Wow, the way he made that beat come in to pick up the tempo there in the backdrop, it was really subtle with the bass just very gently starting to ascend up into this instrumental that's now picking up speed. Very brilliant approach. First off, I would like to start there. Very brilliant approach on the crescendo. And the, the lyrics of this song have like a totally different vibe and feeling to them when they're sung in this manner. He has a very powerfully emotional voice, doesn't he? Wow. I love the chorus, the, the rasp on the chorus and the pure emotion of his approach to that is so intense. I really love this. So, but the lyrics, though, tonight I want to give it all to you. In the darkness, there's so much I want to do. And tonight I want to lay it at your feet. Because, girl, I was made for you. And, girl, you were made for me. I was made for loving you. You were made for loving me. And I can't get enough of you. Can you get enough of me? That's about the, the only way that you would want it to feel ideally, right? Beautiful, beautiful song, actually. It's very meaningful. Kiss has so much meaning inside of their songs, even though they have, like, the risque element to the way they approach things. Obviously, that's just a Kiss thing and always has been that rock and roller kind of aspect to the lyrics. But the, the emotion and the fucking vibe of Kiss's lyrics is so deep. There's so many great songs with so much meaning and passion inside of their catalog. And this is a classic example of that. I love that Youngblood decided to do this. This is fucking epic. Yeah! his approach to this seriously i gotta bring it back a little bit i really like what he's done with this here this is like one of the best covers i've ever heard in my life to be completely honest this is up there with lose yourself the casey chambers version of lose yourself this is a wonderful cover i'm so impressed his rasp adds a whole different like layer of emotion to this song, and I really appreciate that. I like that he's like shifted the beat around a little bit to like remix the sound of the song on like the instrumental layer and level of it. And his voice is just it's like pitch perfect to the original, except he's belting a bit more. Like he's much more belty and gritty and raspy with it. And I love it. I really love it. Like I said, this is easily one of the best covers of any song I've ever heard. song here <laughs> so this is a brave person right here young blood is brave as fuck for this 
Because <laughs> those notes are ridiculously high that Paul hits in this part of the song. Absolutely ridiculous. The second verse, though, let's cover the second verse real quick. Tonight, I want to see it in your eyes. He said, feel the tension. There's something that drives me wild. The original lyric is feel the magic. Either one works beautifully. I love it. I love that he added just a slight little shift in there, making it his own a little bit more than he already has. I like little subtleties like that, right? He said, tonight, we're going to make it all come true because, girl, you were made for me. And, girl, I was made for you. Yep. Beautiful way to describe it. Beautiful way to just describe a magical moment that has, like, tension of love inside of it. Of two people kind of just knowing at some point. It's just figured out eventually. You can only look at someone so many times before you fucking falter eventually. You'll crack. If you, if you like, look at them enough times so that there's, like, some sort of feeling there, eventually you'll just fucking crack. It can't be hidden forever. It's just a thing of human nature. It has to be known at some point, regardless of outcome, right? Regardless of outcome. This is describing a situation where there's a lot of tension and a lot of, like, mystery inside of it, right? Some, like unsureness inside of the air but it's like this person obviously from the narrative perspective they are very sure <laughs> they're like oh yeah i think so let's fucking just make this happen and love each other right because i know that i won't be able to get enough of being near you so i hope you feel the same way that's all it is right beautiful song wonderful song Really, really relatable topic, obviously. Everybody loves a good song about this kind of topic right here. The tension of new love is something very, very unique and special to experience, and you hope that you don't have to go through it many times. Hopefully you just find that one person and they end up being your forever person. You don't want to go through this feeling all the time, constantly. Then you'll, it'll be a bad thing. You guys know. <laughs> But Youngblood is doing fantastic. Like I said, easily one of the best covers I've ever heard of a Kiss song as well. Specifically of a Kiss song. They're very hard to cover. Very, very difficult to nail a Kiss cover. Now let's see what my guy does here with this falsetto section. He's crazy for this. lost on you is so good that was one of my favorite reactions we ever did on here that's such a good song but the way that he approached the falsetto section by making it like a slowed down rock and roll style 
breakdown section, right? And he used his power vocals to make it his own instead of trying to, like, hit the falsetto directly the way that Paul Stanley hit it. He built it up as the slowed down breakdown section and then, like, used that to descend the rest of it with that solemn vibe that he started with at the beginning. I love the way he tied it all together. It's very, like, he shifted it from the original and made it his own, certainly. And I love that about covers. Like, you never know what to expect. Especially, like I said, when it comes to sections like that falsetto section, I was like, what's he going to do with that? Is he going to actually try to hit those notes, or is he going to do something else with it? And he did an ascension, where he gradually started belting more and more in that section, and then brought it back down, dove it back down to the same energy as the very beginning. Beautiful structuring. I like the structure of it. He did very good at that. This was a really fucking great cover. I appreciate covers like this a whole lot. Susie, thank you for putting me on to this one. I was not aware that he had done this. Like I said, it's right up the alley of like the level of random. Like I said, that I would expect from him with a cover. And it, it fits perfectly. He did this so well. So much emotion that he added to it with his rasp and the grittiness and the more like soul and approach to it. I love it a whole lot. And I love that he fucking flipped it into the original kind of vibes right in the middle and then descends it back down. Really good. Very, very good right here. Original video for this will be in the description. As always, I gotta leave a like on this for young blood. Thank you guys for tuning in. Go subscribe to Youngblood. Support the artists we have on the channel. Go show them love. They put out some amazing work and amazing art into the world. And It's hard work, man. It's hard work mate, being an artist and staying on your A-game and always coming up with new ideas and things to do and stuff like that. So It's awesome when we see somebody with the level of talent that Youngblood has. I appreciate you sending some through for us to do by him because I haven't done any by Youngblood until you sent these through two days ago so thank you very much i appreciate you susie thank you guys for tuning in go get help for mental health and addiction if you need it live your best life become a better person grow get closer to god get closer to jesus grow in your faith have faith that life will always be better and have faith that you can help other people and you can inspire them as well to live better lives i love you guys thank you for everything we gonna get out of here on vacasa Kobe. A reaction video a day keeps the doctor away. Fuck those apples. Leave a like for me. Comment those suggestions. Subscribe up this way. Bang that notification bell for me. I'll see you guys in the next one. I love you so much. Thank you for everything. Have a blessed night. Peace.